Hi, my grade 11 students. Welcome to EAP class. I know this is your first time to meet this subject, English for academic and professional purposes. But do not worry, for I will be joining you throughout your journey. I am your teacher, Nam Ella Grace S. Edwards. So what do we expect from this subject? In this subject, you are going to develop your communication skills in the English language for academic and professional purposes. In other words, the learnings that you will gain from this subject will help you a lot, especially after senior high school when you pursue higher education or apply for a job. This subject has a total of five chapters which will be covered in one semester or two quarters. In quarter one, you will be studying the first three chapters, namely chapter one, reading academic texts, chapter two, writing a reaction paper, review or critic, and chapter three, writing a concept paper. In quarter two, you will be studying chapters four and five, which are about writing a position paper and writing a report respectively. We will start the subject with module one, which is entitled Reading and Writing Academic Texts. Module one is actually good for three weeks and has six lessons. In week one, you will be having lesson one, which deals with academic text structures, and lesson two, which deals with language use in academic writing. In week two, you will have lesson three, which delves into academic reading strategies, and lesson four, which delves into techniques in summarizing a variety of academic texts. In week three, you will have lesson five, which focuses on this is a statement of an academic text, and lesson six, which focuses on outlining. In each lesson, you will be answering activities and exercises which will help you deepen your knowledge and understanding on the different topics. So that is my overview or brief introduction to English for academic and professional purposes and module one. If you have some questions and concerns regarding any lesson or part of the module, please do not hesitate to contact me. You may message me through my Facebook account, Ella Edwards, or my Facebook page, Ella Edwards Learning Page. Don't be shy, I'm just one click away. See you in my next video.